first match go for you? Uh, it was okay. Uh, I think it's uh, it's good to play in front of a crowd and uh, get a feeling of uh, like uh, how a real league match would be like. And I would say it went okay. Of course, we, were, we should have won, but for me, it was just it's it's still about uh, getting to know the guys and build a, building a good relationship with them. Been there for a bit over a month now, and yeah, we're still working on that. And you have a, a quite a different style from the previous goalkeeper you come off the line more. You seem very vocal. Are are those adjustments being absorbed into the defense? Uh. Yeah, I don't. To be honest, I don't really know what uh, Ricketts' style was, but I'm just trying to be myself, and that's the way I play, and that's what they're gonna get, and that's also a part of uh, getting to know the guys. Like, they also need to get to know me and the way I play. So, so uh, yeah. Uh, when it comes to sort of getting to know uh, your defenders, like you say. Um, what uh, what do you think is is the most important adjustment that they need to make when they're playing with a keeper who's going to come out aggressively like you do sometimes? Oh, it's uh, like the communication and the, like how we react to to uh, like how they react to my actions and how I react to their, their actions. Uh, I mean, when you come off your line. Like I do a lot, then, uh, then the like the chemistry or the the connection has to be perfect, because sometimes it can, it can cause situations, like maybe some yeah, silly situations. But uh, yeah, I mean, it will go fast, and I think I think that uh, it's easy to easy to kind of adjust to uh, to uh, to the way I I play. For 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 uh, the defenders, they can they can use me whenever they want to. I'm comfortable with my feet, so so uh, yeah. I think I think it's it's uh, the main the main uh, main difference without knowing Ricketts is that uh, I'm I believe or I think that I uh, I might be more involved than he is was and. Uh Obviously, Liam Ridgewell uh, was away for the first part of preseason. Um, he's been back with the team for a little bit now. Uh, how's uh, how's your relationship uh, coming together with uh, with him as well as Matt? Mm, he's, he's he's easy to play with. Uh, got a lot of experience and talks a lot. A leader, and it's really easy to to yeah, like I said, play with him and. Uh, I think I can learn a lot from him, even though he's just a couple of years older than me. Because uh, his presence and and yeah, everything is it's uh, it makes me safe. Yeah, like I feel safe with him, and uh, and that's a good uh, good thing to have for a, for a player. What do you know about Stevek? <laughs> uh, it's uh, <laughs> I've played against him hundred times and. Uh, yeah, it's a it's a young team. They've uh, been through a bit of a change the last uh, couple of years. Uh, went through some financial, uh, uh, like the economy wasn't that good in the club, and they had to to change that. And a lot of young players and a good coach, uh, which get a maximum out of all these players. So I mean. It's a good team, but not too much of a experience, I think, compared to us. I think we have a, we got a lot of experience in our our team, so so I think it will be a, in, an interesting game. What does Portland have to do, and what are you looking to do to get a good result? Oh, I like it's a part of the preseason, the last game before the for the league starts and. We just have to work on what we've been working on all, all throughout the whole preseason, and uh, try to try to build on the on our attacking movements and our attacking play, and also our defensive shape. And if we if we just play like like we normal like how we should play or normal, then I think we will get a good result against Salah.